Since being set the challenge of interacting with our children more while they're using technology, I've been making a conscious effort to get my camera out as well and film what we've been doing. Over the past couple of weeks, we've watched a couple of films and TV programmes together. Father Christmas delivered an Xbox for Christmas, so we've spent our time together figuring out this, setting up our own characters and learning how to play the games we got for it. Which has generally been good fun. Because of the Xbox, tablets haven't been out quite so much these holidays. But these are the kind of games we normally play. My turn to... <laughs> <laughs> so you jump, I'll, I'll, I'll press. Robin, can you tell me what you like about Angry Birds? Um, it's fun. Mm -hmm. How does it make you feel when you're playing it? Happy. Mm -hmm. And why do you like going back to that game? Mm, don't know. Do you know what, Bobby? What? Mummy likes Angry Birds too. We also like to use my phone to access YouTube and listen to a lot of music together. The Cranberries and Kate Bush are Hazel's favourites. Currently, the children don't very often go online for homework, but the boys um, are using an app called Timetable Rockstars at the moment to improve on their maths. So it's something like that you can do your homework on. What kind of homework? Maths homework. At the moment, you can just do garage to up your month to practice for studio. Studio is where you can improve your speed. Mm -hmm. And it can you show me it? That's studio, that's loud, that's sound check. Sound check is help to help make you quicker. That's practice as well. And you can play with against the rest of your class on here. So why do you play it? To improve my math scores. Okay. Speed. Because at the end of like the term we compete against other schools in it. I would say this challenge improved our relationship with the children because when we use tech with them, um, their self-awareness and the way they, the, well, the way we end up regulating their screen time is better and causes less arguments than when, um, than when they're left to it. I think my ch childhood was uh, relatively tech-free. Um, there was no handheld devices. Do you think you understand the children's perspectives on technology? Um, I think they've grown up with technology uh, a lot better than I have. I think they've got it more balanced. As a teenager, I got my first games console and I found that quite addictive. Um, I think that the kids get quite addictive on the consoles as well. My childhood perspective is slightly different. Um, I had computers, I had Mega Drives, I had um, a portable Game Gear, which isn't vastly different to a tablet, I suppose. So do I understand their perspective on technology? I suppose I do, in a way. Um, but obviously, when it comes to what they have to do on computers at school, it's a whole different world to what I grew up with. Adam and I have really enjoyed our tech time with the children these holidays, because back in the day, we were actually rather big gamers ourselves too.